Here's my wood stove, and it's full of ash. Step one, for safety's sake, is put a pair of gloves on so you don't burn your fingers. The stove might be hot while you're doing this operation, and it's always best to take precautions. On this stove, there's a side damper. You want to make sure it's open first. Damper position is back. That just opened up an internal damper so that the smoke clears out. Then I slowly lift the lid. In this case, the fire is not burning, so there's no problem with smoking. But if you try to open the lid with the damper closed, you will get smoke leaving the fireplace or leaving the stove. You can see there's a large amount of ash accumulated in here from burning previous uh, fires. And what I want to do is take a shovel or a poker and I will agitate, stir the ashes. You can see the ashes falling down through the grate into the ash pan below. See that the ashes have fallen down through. All that remains here is the coals, the, what could be hot embers or just unburned fuel. So you're going to basically open up the ash door. This is one of the key and one of the nice features of the Encore stove. The ash pan swings out. The dust lid slides over the ash pan. And I can take the ashes out and safely dispose of the ash either in the garden where it's very good for, your, for the uh, vegetables or I can dispose of it in a metal container with a lid. Very important point here, make sure in, at this step to close this door. There is a latch and if this door is not closed securely you would create an unsafe condition by an unlimited amount of air coming up through the bottom and causing the stove to overheat. Dispose of the ashes in a metal container. Okay, we've dumped the ashes in a metal container. We want to go back to the stove, open up the door, and put the stove. Okay, this is Bill, the fireplace expert. I just taught you how to take ashes out of your Encore stove.